Hey guys, my name's Ash and welcome to Enus Tech. In today's video, we are taking a look at the Drevo or Drevo Calibre RGB Mechanical Keyboard. I've been using it personally myself for, I would say, two to three weeks now for online gaming and editing videos, and I've become quite fond of it. It's not something I'm going to continue using, but I did have a good experience with it, and I'm going to talk you through what I found out by using it. So from looking at it at a quick glance, you can notice there's not much branding, logos, or writing really on the keyboard, only a small logo on the spacebar which is really minimalistic and in my opinion looks great. It doesn't feel cheap even though it kind of is in comparison to other RGB wireless keyboards. I think it's got a good build to it. As I said I've been using it for around two to three weeks now and I've hardly had to clean it. It doesn't attract much dust or really any dirt at all which is great. In comparison to the last keyboard I was using and may return to, I found myself using a wet wipe or trying to clean it nearly every other day trying to get dust off it just so it still looks nice and clean. Now let's get onto the RGB lighting, it's a bit of a strange one, it has plenty, plenty of choices but I feel it's still missing some key colours just such as like pink, orange, it only has limited colours but has loads of different modes so it breathes, it swipes left to right, if you touch different keys it, it, it changes colours of, of certain keys, stuff like that so it has got loads of different modes but it's just odd if I had the memory why it's not saving different colours. Personally I like to match all my peripheral, if I had a mouse with a, a pink or an orange LED this would pretty much ruin it for me. It doesn't have the option which is a bit of a shame the weirdest part of this keyboard is I can't seem to manage to find a print screen button I've checked the manual I can't see anything clearly on the keyboard that states the replacement but what I've managed to do to battle this is to actually download a third-party app and assign a different key uh, to print screen for me which isn't an issue but for some people I can see it being quite annoying if you don't know about third party products. Would I recommend this product? I'm going to be brutally honest I feel like you could probably get a cheaper bigger keyboard with RGB lighting as well even though this is wireless has the Bluetooth function which is great it doesn't really benefit me or I can imagine most people they seem to be targeting gamers everyone that I know personally wouldn't dare dream about using a wireless keyboard for online gaming especially competitive due to input lag or if it connects it will be horrible so unfortunately the caliber doesn't get any sort of awards from Enos Tech in this review it is a very nice keyboard and if you have a minimalistic setup or not a lot of space you know it would look really really nice but in a day-to-day -day use it's not something that I would continue using and isn't practical for a day-to-day -day basis anyways guys if you are new around here please make sure you subscribe we are dropping a lot more content day by day please leave a like and a comment and I'll check you in the next video peace